10 Most Educated African Leaders The importance of education and intellect as a cornerstone and an appreciable trait for leadership cannot be emphasized, as it is proven time and time again in most cases. It is the responsibility of leaders in their different cabinets to make all decisions that affect the growth, development, and future of their respective countries and territories. It should come as no surprise that the majority of African leaders are making an effort to further their education. Even the pattern throughout the years that some of the world's most educated presidents have hailed from the continent. In this video, we will celebrate the educational achievements of the 10 most educated leaders on the African continent, and we will do it with awe and admiration. Welcome to Think Rich Media, the community which brings to you entrepreneurial, business, and personal development content to inform, motivate, and inspire you. We also want to introduce you to our special African development playlist because we strongly believe entrepreneurship, rather than global pity, is the key to Africa's growth and development. So, if you're African and you aren't subscribed to our community, you're missing out. 10. Hage Gottfried Jengob Hage Gottfried Jengob is Namibia's third and current president, having taken office on March 21, 2015. Jane Gobb served as Namibia's first Prime Minister from March 21, 1990, to August 28, 2002, and then again from December 4, 2012, to March 21, 2015. Jane Gobb was the Minister of Trade and Industry from 2008 to 2012. Jean Gobb moved to the United States in 1964 to pursue a scholarship at Temple University in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. In 1970, he received a Bachelor of Arts degree from Fordham University in New York City, and in 1974, he received a Master of Arts degree in International Relations from the graduate faculty of the New School in New York. Nine, Rockmark Christian Cabor. Rockmark Christian Cabor, a Burkinay politician, was born on April 25, 1957, and has been the president of Burkina Faso since 2015. Between 1994 and 1996, he was prime minister of Burkina Faso, and from 2002 to 2012, he was president of the National Assembly of Burkina Faso. Cabor was also the president of the Congress for Democracy and Progress, CDP, until 2014 when he resigned. In the same year, he launched the People's Movement for Progress. He majored in business administration at the University of Burgundy, a public university in Dijon, France, where he received his Bachelor of Arts in 1979 and his Master's in 1980. 8. George Mane Apong Wee George Mane Apong Wee is a Liberian politician and former professional footballer who has served as the country's 25th president since 2018. Wee previously served as a senator from Montserrado County before being elected to the presidency. Former FIFA World Player of the Year and Ballon d'Or winner, he is probably one of Africa's best soccer players and the first to receive such honors. George Wee earned a master's degree in management from Keller Graduate School of Management and two bachelor's degrees in business administration and sports management from the VRY University Miami and Parkway University, respectively. 7. Fora Nassingby Since 2005, Fora Nassingby has served as the president of Togo. Prior to his 10 years in government, he was assigned to ministerial roles in mining, equipment, telecommunications, and postings by his father, former president of Togo Nasingbi Aidma, from 2003 to 2005. Following President Aidma's death in 2005, Nasingbi was sworn in as president with the army's backing. Doubts about the successions constitutional legality led to intense regional pressure on Nasingbi, who eventually resigned on February 25. On April 24, 2005, he was sworn in as president after winning a contentious presidential election. In 2010, Nasingbi was re-elected for a second term. Nasingbi received his secondary education in Lomni before moving to Paris to pursue a degree in Fien. 
He went on to earn a master's degree in business administration from George Washington University in Washington, D.C. 6. D.C. 6. Prithviraj Rupan. Prithviraj Rupan, born 24 May 1959, is a Mauritius politician who has served as the country's sixth and current president since 2019. He was born in Quater Borns and grew up in the neighborhood of Morsalman St. Jean. He attended secondary school at Rose Hills New Eton College and worked at Eton College as a mathematics instructor. Since 1986, he has been qualified and admitted to practice law as an attorney at law. He also lectured at the University of Mauritius Faculty of Law. Mr. Rupon holds a master's degree in International Business Law LLM, from the University of Central Lancashire and has served on the Council of Legal Education's Board of Examiners for over 15 years. He has also lectured at the University of Mauritius Faculty of Law. Five, Jorge Carlos Fonseca. Jorge Carlos de Almeida Fonseca Oic is a Cape Verdean politician, attorney, and university professor who served as the country's president from 2011 to 2021. From 1991 until 1993, he served as Minister of Foreign Affairs. Between 1982 and 1990, he worked as a graduate teaching assistant at the University of Lisbon's Faculty of Law. As an invited professor of criminal law at the Lisbon Institute of Forensic Medicine in 1987, and as a resident director and invited associate professor at the University of Asia Oriental Macau's law course in public administration in 1989 and 1990. 4. Alassane Outara. Alassane Outara is a politician from Ivory Coast who has served as the country's president since 2010. Adhara, an economist by training, worked for the International Monetary Fund and the central banks of West African states. From November 1990 to December 1993, he served as Prime Minister of Cote d'Ivoire. He earned a Bachelor of Science degree in 1965 from Drexel Institute of Technology in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, which is now known as Drexel University. Adhara then earned a master's degree in economics from the University of Pennsylvania in 1967 and a doctorate in economics from the university in 1972. 3. King Mohammed VI Mohammed VI, born on August 21, 1963, is Morocco's monarch. He is a member of the Alawite dynasty and succeeded to the throne upon the death of his father on 23 July 1999. King Mohammed VI of Morocco has been ranked as Africa's third most educated sovereign due to his illustrious academic record. Mohammed earned his first degree in political science in 1987 and a diploma in public law in July 1988. Mohammed received his PhD in law with distinction from the French University of Nice Stafia and Polis on 29 October 1993 for his thesis on the EEC Maghreb ties. 2. John Paul Magafuli Tanzanian politician and the country's sixth president John Palm, Magafuli is ranked second on our ranking of Africa's 10 most educated presidents. He began his political career as a member of parliament in 1995 and progressed through many ministerial roles before ascending to the highest rank. President John Magafuli's administration has been tenacious in its efforts to curb government corruption and theft while reinvesting resources in Tanzania's industry. Magafuli got a Bachelor of Science and Education degree from the University of Dar es Salaam in 1988, with a concentration in chemistry and mathematics as his teaching subjects. He also got master's and doctoral degrees in chemistry from the University of Dar es Salaam, respectively, in 1994 and 2009. 1. Abi Ahmed at the top of our list is one of Africa's most promising young leaders. Abi Ahmed Ali, 44 years old, has served as Ethiopia's fourth prime minister since April 2, 2018. 
Abby got his first degree, a bachelor's degree in computer engineering, from the Microlink Information Technology College in Addis Ababa in 2009, while serving in the Ethiopian National Defense Force. In 2011, he earned a Master of Arts in Transformative Leadership from Greenwich University London's Business School in cooperation with the International Leadership Institute Addis Ababa. He also possesses a master's degree in business administration from Addis Ababa's Lead Star College of Management and Leadership, which is affiliated with Ashland University. Abby began his Doctor of Philosophy work as a regular student several years ago and earned his PhD in 2017 from the Institute for Peace and Security Studies. He was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize in 2019 for his efforts to promote peace and international collaboration most notably for his decisive push to resolve the border issue with neighboring Eritrea. These are the 10 most educated African leaders. African has produced an incredible number of intellectual luminaries. However, continental expansion has been rather slow. It is consequently critical to have educated leaders who have the continent's best interests at heart. These are principles that might contribute to continental alignment and growth. Thank you for watching. If you know about other educated leader in Africa who didn't make the list, do share this information in the comments section. Help our channel grow. We hope this video has been helpful to you. Support us by liking the video, subscribing, and turning on your notifications.